Hey guys, it's me, Poppy Rain here, coming to you with my third video of the day. We are opening another package. This package is from Pimu. So, I don't know exactly what's in here because I don't know which package it is because I have so many coming. But I think I have some idea. I think it was the first order I put in. I'm guessing this is what this is, which, if that's true, this is all Christmas gifts. What is this? We have item number one. I have no clue what this is. Okay. What is this? I don't know what size this is. This is a... unspeakable i don't know what unspeakable is but i know it has something to do with mr beast who, which i know who mr beast is i mean i am a youtuber so it's an unbeastable mr beast hoodie this looks like super crappy quality and it looks super small it says it's supposed to fit a five to six year old. This looks super small. So hopefully it fits. So that's item number one. This is the one we got for Grayson. Um, we are going to get him the shirt to go with it. I just have not ordered them yet. I'm pretty sure that's the one for Grayson. So I think I ordered Grayson's and one of Corbin's. Because they had two different styles, and the one style they did not have in Corbin's size. We have, this is from Pat Pat, apparently. Because apparently Pat Pat sells on Timo. Oh! Okay, I do know what this is. This is Gabe's little car seat poncho, because they don't recommend you wear... Coats in the car. This is not what I thought it was. I thought it had sleeves and I thought it was going to be thicker. Um, He does have a snowsuit that does work in the car seat. The other one is way too thick. But we got him this little car seat poncho. Okay, this is Corbin Teddy. So we got another unspeakable hoodie. I am gonna I do have a backpack that I got off a of free group that has the same design on it, which I am gonna fill up with some of his gifts. But we have this one. It's that like Kind of stretchy jersey material, I guess you'd call it. So we have that one. I don't remember what else was in this order. I think there should be two, one or two more items in this order. I, like I said, I can't, I ordered so many, I have so many orders coming from Tmail. I don't know what's in what order. But I am getting Corbin a hoodie like the one I got for Grayson, just a different colorway. They did not have that one in Grayson's size. Okay, so there is only one more thing in here. So this I'm super excited about. This I'm not really going to take out of the package, but this is a really cool vest that has i don't know how it works but somehow this vest heats up
This must not be one that plugs in, I don't think. I think this is one of the ones that uses your body heat. Because it has the, like, reflective lining inside. I thought it was... So my director has a coat. That heats up and it's got like charging banks in it to heat it up. <laughs> That's not as bad as losing a pet. <laughs> You're fine. I'm not saying it's not sad, but still, it's one less thing you have to do. Okay, I'll have to let you know because I don't know if I have anything going on after work tomorrow. Sorry, I'm responding to some messages. Um, but yeah. So I thought this would be good because... Oh, wait, what does this mean? Tells you how it works right here, apparently. You can see that. Um, because Daddy just, as you guys may or may not know, Daddy switched stores. <clears throat> so that he could... What do I want to say? He switched stores. Oh, so that he could get a raise and a manager position. So... He, so he does help out at the store by the house still. But at the other store... So, he works at two... He technically, for tax purposes and whatever, works at the store closer to B's house. But he does work at the store closer to B's house and the store next to our house that he was originally working at. He did, however, technically transfer over to the store by B's house, closer to B's house. Because they told him that he was going to get more hours. He was going to get the manager position, which was going to be more hours and $2 more for pay. Which is only a dollar and change less than what he was making at Five Below. But they told him that almost a month ago. And it's getting really ridiculous that he has to ride. Because that takes him 20 minutes to get over there. But when he works at the store by the house, it's like a five-minute walk. It takes him five minutes to get over there to walk. But then it takes him 20 minutes to ride his bike over to the other store. And I know you're going to say, well, why doesn't he take the car? Because it would take me four hours to walk to work. And our schedules don't usually click to where he can either get me to work or he can pick me up. There's never a time he can take me and pick me up because I work 9 to 6. And the latest he goes in is 5. And I don't get out typically before 5.30. I get out between 5.30 and 6 typically, even though I'm scheduled till 6. 
So, basically, so there's not a time, and he goes into work anytime between 8 a.m. and 5 p.m. And then gets out of work anytime between 2 p.m. and 10 p.m. So, like, today he worked at the, he was only supposed to work 8 to 2. So, with that being said... If he worked 8 to 2, he wouldn't, if he had taken the car, he would have had no way to get me to, I would have had no way to work, but he would have been able to pick me up. But because he picked up this shift, he had no way to pick me up from work. And we, because we share a car. So that's why he bikes to work. Or, and honestly... If he works at the store by the house, I don't care. I don't feel guilty about him having to walk or anything because it's literally... Most of the time, if I go to, like, the antique store or something and I'm home, I'll walk over there because it's stupid to waste the time and the gas to go less than five minutes away. So, because driving, it takes, like, two minutes to drive. It actually takes longer to get in the car than it does to get over there. So, that's why he bikes to work and I ride to work. Or, and I have the car. But, anywho. I'm going to go. And I will catch you on the flip side. Bye, guys.